What our organization does, it, it really is the voice of the homeless on Long Island. When we started it back in 1985, we wanted to bring together all the groups that were scattered through Nassau and Suffolk County that were working for the homeless, but most of us were very small, independent, non-for-profits. And we decided to really give a good voice to the homeless and the poor of Long Island. We needed to get us all together where we could speak as a unit. Today we have 150 to 200 different organizations that throughout the year are working with the Suffolk Coalition to help the homeless in Nassau and Suffolk County. Everything from permanent housing for people with disabilities, individuals and families, uh, transitional housing for individuals and families who really just need a little bit of time to kind of get themselves back on their feet. The only difference in most cases between the homeless that we're working with and all of their neighbors is one of economics. Imagine a mom with two kids on, in Suffolk County earning $24,000 a year, um, and that's close to 15%, that they're at, at immediate risk of homelessness. So at any given point, you have that number of people. In addition, we do have uh, among the highest foreclosure rates throughout the country. One of the major jobs that we do on Long Island is help bring in $10 million of federal money to Nassau and Suffolk County every year. And we bring that in to build and keep operating many houses for uh, homeless families and individuals with disabilities. Both county leaders have come forward and support our effort. The community supports us because they see what we're doing is good. They see that once we put the houses up, they're well maintained. They create jobs inside the community. The people that are in the houses are very well behaved. They become part of the community. The best kind of success stories that we have is when a, a homeless family that's been, that's been living in shelter, unfortunately lost everything, is able to move into a new housing program.